What is going on guys? Gray here. Today I'm going to talk about the companion system and how I think there needs to be some changes made to the system overall before they add new companions into the game. Before I get into all the details, be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky, where you can use code GRAVE at checkout for 5% off, and Amazon Associates. I have a lot of stuff linked in the description that I use every day when gaming or when doing YouTube videos, some things you might be interested in. Also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well. And be sure if you're not sub to the channel to hit that subscribe button. Now, when it comes to the companion system, I think a lot of people were disappointed that we did not get a new companion or at least one with the Deadlands DLC. In my personal opinion, I think we're probably going to get two companions a year, probably with the big, you know, purchasable DLC every year. And Zoss will probably do that for the next couple of years. Now, I'm not a big fan of that. I think people wanted to see more, uh, you know, variety when it came to uh, what companions they could have. But like I said, just my opinion, I don't think we're probably going to see more than two companions a year. I wish it was a little bit different than that, but I, I just don't think it's gonna, that's going to be the case. But when it comes to the companion system in general, if they're going to really stick with this idea of putting in companions in the game, and it's not just kind of a, you know, afterthought thing, you know, where it's just something they add in for a little bit of extra content, I think there could be some really significant changes to this. And one of those things would be reducing rapport and the XP grind. For players that actually use companions, and I know not everyone out there does, not all players are going to use companions. If you're a PvP or if you're an in-game trial player, you're not really using companions. In my opinion, the companions are for newer players, for solo players, that kind of thing. But the rapport and the XP grind is pretty ridiculous, as we all know, and I think that could be adjusted somewhat. Uh, of course, I think they could probably really have more utility or, you know, be a little bit better at what they do mechanic-wise or whatever the case may be when it comes to how they act or interact with the world. A lot of people feel like it's just having another pet. I've seen that comment so many times uh, within forums and my, even my YouTube videos uh, when, when I've been talking about companions. A lot of people feel like it's just having another pet. It's really not useful. So I think if they could add a bit more utility or make them more viable uh, for you know solo play, that would be a great thing. Allowing them to go in solo arenas would be I think a game changer for a lot of people. Now I know you can get things from uh, Maelstrom and whatnot now uh, in normal mode. It's not like it was years ago when I first started playing. You had to do veteran runs to be able to get those Maelstrom weapons. And it took me about 500 runs to do that. And early on in the game, if you played a long, long time ago, when it first came out, sometimes you were not even guaranteed a drop at the end. So you could do Maelstrom on veteran and not get anything. So I can understand why some people say there's no need for them to be in solo now because you can just do it on normal. But even for a newer player that's low level, that's doing it on normal, it would be nice to have, I think, something there to kind of help them out if the companion would interact correctly and actually do some tanking, healing, that kind of thing. Um, I think another thing that really needs to be added in is the companions to have their own inventory space. A lot of people like to keep a lot of different gear with their companions, you know, so they can be a tank healer. You know, DPS, some people may want to keep a set for all three of those kind of classes. And it takes up a lot of in inventory space in your personal character space or, you know, your uh, your personal bank space. So the companions having their own inventory space would be huge. Overall, I, I think if those few changes were made, the companion system would be improved. I probably have not thought of some things that it probably could be, uh, you know, updated with that as well. Or, you know, could be added in to make the companion system a little bit better. But... Like I said, if Zoss is going to continue to go down this road of adding companions in every year, I kind of expect that to be the case for the next couple of years. Like I said at the start of the video, I really think some work needs to be done on this. Uh, it may be, like I said, it may just kind of be an afterthought for, for, um, for Zoss. It may be something that they weren't really planning on going too in-depth with. They just want it to be there for you know a little bit of extra content for some players but then they want to focus on other content uh, more when the DLC comes out. And I understand that, that a lot of players probably would feel that they are kind of hope that they do that uh, because they're not really big fans of companions. But to me, if you're going to have the companion system, I think it, can, it could be upgraded. And also I think they should add more than, you know, just a couple companions a year. So you have a lot of selection of what you want to do there because it is kind of annoying to have two companions where you can't, you know, go out and do things for, you know, Thieves Guild, Dark Brotherhood, without really losing rapport, and sometimes you just forget to have the uh, you know to put those companions away. So 
that is a bit annoying. So hopefully we'll get some better things for the companion system and some different companions here in the near future. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you'd like to hit the like and I'll catch you next time. Peace.